Good every, good every, good afternoon, everybody, and welcome to today's vlog. Uh, Audrey had a doctor's appointment, and uh, I was just going to miss them. In fact, have some a little bit of alone time at home, but I got a call from Megan on the way home, and I just needed a little extra help, so I'm going to go see the girls and uh, probably be here for part of the appointment. So let's go see the girls, and Audrey should be okay. It's just a regular checkup. We'll see how it goes. All right, flash forward a couple hours. Uh, obviously, I didn't really film anything after our introduction. Uh, I pretty much went into the doctor's office, grabbed Quinn and Kaylee, and then left, and then Megan and uh, that other one, Audrey. <laughs> Number one. The other one. The other one. She, uh, they basically were only three minutes behind us anyway, but either way, um, it, something interesting going on, and the fact that this happened two weeks ago probably makes you think that this actually does happen more than it does but once again if you can see back there there's no one back there Woo! Woo! so Megan and I were just kind of joking around that hey you know I wish someone could watch the girls tonight and we could just you know go out just the two of us because it'll be one of the last times we have a chance to do that before baby is born and I was like eh, all right I'll text Aiden so texted my friend Aiden who helped us out with our gender reveal, he and his wife, and they're like, yeah, sure, we can watch the girls. So we are out on another date, which, for crying out loud, the last time we had two dates without the girls in a two week period was probably when we didn't have kids. So this is great, doesn't happen a lot. We're probably just gonna go out to dinner and just spend some time together. The girls absolutely love Aiden and Kayla which is uh, where they're at right now. So they were excited about it. And uh, yeah, we get to have some alone time, which we probably aren't gonna have a lot of that for a long, long time, because baby over there is coming any time. Uh, no new progressions today, so not really an update to give you all, other than just more of the usual. I mean, Megan still has some contractions here and there throughout the day, but nothing to warn us going to the hospital. So nothing really to update you on since we gave big updates with uh, Dr. Chocolate Pudding yesterday. So uh, we're just going to go have some fun, just the two of us. And, you know, who knows? Maybe we'll get a chance to do something again before or after baby Kenny is born, but this is likely probably our last time alone except for after the girls go to bed until he's born. So I kind of joked around with... Yeah, I might rock around the mall. Who knows? Maybe we'll go to the comic book store again since that's my thing now, apparently. I don't know why. Well, you know... Can you, can you really call me a nerd when I go for Donald Duck comic books? That's more like a dork. Like a Disney nerd. Well, I am a Disney nerd and I'm not afraid to admit it. It'll be fun. Either way, we're going to have fun just being alone we love our girls and i think all parents out there can agree you love your kids but you gotta get away from them for a while so we're excited about that one. that's never ending possible right okay i expect you to go through at least three of those double the size of that belly <laughs> it'll be a food baby and a real baby in the meantime i've got the salmon and the broccoli it's delicious you can even finish that first one but hey, we don't have the girls with us. I'm not full, so... And we don't know what to talk about. <laughs> we were just talking about fake names, like Squeegee Beckham. Or Triple Horn. Yes, she's a fine actress. <laughs> Love you. Love you too. We just left our dinner. It was awesome. We had dinner, just the two of us. Yeah. Although this is the third day in a row that we've eaten out, I realize. Yeah. We'll get back into good habits. But we didn't expect to be going out on a date. We actually have chicken that's still on our counter, thawing out, that nobody's eating because I fixed the girls chicken nuggets and tater tots. And there's a reason they don't give you instructions on the tater tot bag on how to microwave them. Because they don't microwave them. Don't microwave them. They get mushy. But now it's kind of fun because we can go into the mall and we can walk anywhere we want and go into any store we want for as long or short as we want without worrying about people. We could go to fans. We to we're fans. totally going to fans. Every time we walk into fans, which if you're not from here is kind of a, a sports apparel store, they always freak out. And 
immediately. This fan's local. Yeah, at least it started local. So we're gonna have to go in just to say we did. We'll have to check out a couple other places that actually want to go first. All right, so we're leaving the mall, and we just got back to the car. And this tells you how often we go out alone. I get back to the van, and we've got the uh, clicker, basically the remote for the van, and it's got buttons to open the side doors to the back. And we get here, and I'm trying to open the door for Megan, and I realize I just opened the side doors. And because... <laughs> And, and Megan's like, what are you, on autopilot? Yes, I am on autopilot. I'm not used to going somewhere where I don't have to open up those doors. So, we've had a good time though, yeah? Yeah. We've been alone. We went into a few places that normally we either wouldn't go into or would be reluctant to go into because we know the girls are just going to have a meltdown and ultimately just had... Had a good chance to spend some time together, and I like spending time with this pretty girl over here. And I think most of the time she puts up with the fact that she's forced to spend time with me too, so. <laughs> Get some light on in here. I'm cute. Aww. You don't have to lie in front of our fans. <laughs> I'm not lying. <laughs> I appreciate it, you're pretty cute too. So we're gonna go, uh, go get the girls and put him down but it was fun to have some time just mom and dad it's gonna be probably a pretty short vlog I'll edit what we have and kind of squish it together it'll be pretty short but you know what sometimes it's good just to have that time alone and and to have you join with us and I'm sure anyone out there that watches this and has kids can relate to what it's like so we appreciate the love and support we got a new subscriber today and we appreciate you as well. Um, we're gonna keep these vlogs rolling. I really want to get some good streaks going and if nothing else, set a record for the most vlogs in a month for the month of March. So this will be two days in a row. So yeah, it's short. There's not really a whole lot of content to it, but we've got some fun things that are coming up besides the fact that we're gonna have a sun soon. Megan, two weeks or less. I know. That's crazy. Am I even in a lane here? I am now so thanks again for coming along with us on this ride there's two days in a row let's see if we can make it three tomorrow we probably will uh, Megan's got a baby shower and I've got nothing to do with the girls because they cleaned their room today which they were supposed to do tomorrow so it'll be kind of fun anyway thanks again we love you so much stick with us don't forget to share these help us grow and it's from you sharing it with those that you love, especially if you're someone that knows us personally. Share it with other people that know us that maybe haven't seen it yet. Uh, subscribe if you haven't done already. Don't forget to tell those that you love you love them. Megan, I love you. I love you too. Uh, make happiness viral. Keep in tune. Keep in tune. La, 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 la. Stay tuned because any day now, we could be coming to you with Baby vlog. Baby watch 2018. Baby watch 2018. And Megan, go ahead and finish it off. And in the words of Quinn, see you around tomorrow on the next video. Bye.